How's it going, you gorgeous people? And welcome to another episode of Spurvers, the show where we talk about everything that's got us absolutely excited to be Spurs fans. And for the third week in a row, it is hashtag Team Craig. We're still here, Boom. going strong. How about that? All right, let's get into our first topic of Spurvets this week, and it is Lamella's loan deal to Inter Milan for a reported six million. How do you six feel? Six million euros. Uh, well, it, this is. Uh, I don't know how I feel because it's not happened yet, and it needs to happen. This is it, ever since we signed him. There's been talk about clubs from Italy wanting to take him back. Yeah. It has to happen. Like we, we, I've just reached the end of my tether with this kid. I, re- I wanted it to work so much. So did I. So did I. It's just reaching that point now where we just need to move him on. He, ne- he needs to go back to Italy. Back oh, to. He does. He scored 15 goals in that season for Roma. The I season know, before crazy. we signed him. And made almost as many assists. And what's he done at the club? Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, we've got to send him back. Um, yeah. Six million. How do you feel about that fee? It's just a loan deal. Six, That's six That's million right. euros. Six million euros. What's that okay. about? Four point. 4.2, 4.4 yeah. or something yeah. like that. I mean, that's decent for a year. And then it can lean on, it can yeah, lean on to, sorry, they're maybe signing in permanently. Yeah, 14, for a 14 million pound option, I think, at the end of it, which we would just bite their hands oh, off. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll just be take, take it in a heartbeat. All right, so that's the first thing that's got us perverted. The second thing we're going to talk about is Berahino's transfer request. Now, it did get rejected. We're fully aware that Jeremy mm. Peace is not letting the man go, but the fact that he handed it in. That's exciting. Look, the, the, he doesn't he, want to be there. He is coming to Spurs. The kid is coming to Spurs. Let's no, be honest no, about no. it. All this talk from Tony Pulis about there being 15 clubs that are interested oh, in signing whatever. him. It, that is complete bull. Oh. We all know, they know, and we know that he's coming to Spurs. It's, it's, just, just, the, it's just juggling, isn't it? It's just going back and forth to try and see the, what, who, who's going to get him for what price. But do you know what's bang out of order? We're giving them Fazio. Shouldn't there be some sort of deal implemented there? Exchange you would have thought money? so. You would have thought so. But these deals are so technical nowadays there's so many different things involved that sometimes it's not as easy as it sounds to p- make one deal happen as part of the other but at the end of the day if we're doing business with the club yeah. I agree with you let's just get this thing sorted and let's get we him should. in so West Brom's a very simple club very <laughs> full of simple people okay they're, they're gonna need Don't... to sign a replacement as well yeah they so are, look, they they're gonna want to get rid of him I, I see this happening quite no quickly. well they've got Lambert and who's the other guy well, what's his what's Rondon his? Rondon they've got a couple yeah. replacements there so yeah. you know it's, it's all in place it's just a matter of time before he comes to White Hart Lane. All right, let's get on to the last topic, and it has to be Delhi Ali's performance versus Leicester. Mustard. The kid is mustard. Mustard. Ooh, mustard. Is that the word now? Yeah, yeah. The kid is mustard. All right, all right. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm like spreading that. someone out on my hot dog. Oh. I don't quite know what that means, but uh, <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> but no, he was absolutely amazing. Uh, he only came on for about 30 minutes. He grabbed us a goal, and he just yeah. looked really, really up for it. Yeah, and that's what we need. I mean, again, he scored 16 goals for MK Dons, and okay, we're talking about you know a few levels down back in League yeah. One. But he's got everything, this kid, and I, I was pleased to see him playing in that advanced position. Yeah. I think it's quite interesting. We, we've got potential to play him in a few different areas. Mm. You know, he, he could play central defensive midfield. He can play in the hole, maybe on the on the on one of the flanks. But yeah, the kid has got it all, and I'm, I'm really excited by and it. And one of the most interesting things about him, to me, that stands out, like, he just seems fearless. Yeah. Like he's up for every chance. He yeah. megged Modric. Yeah. Yeah. And Tony Cruz. I'm aware it was just a flipping Audi Cup, but he made both of them and then scores a goal against Leicester. I think he's going to be a, a fan favourite. He's mustard, say it, he's mustard. He's mustard. Yes. All right, guys, well, this has been the first episode of Spurverts Part 1. Stay tuned for Part 2, where Craig Vai will be taking over. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and leave a comment below. Hello, guys, this is Craig Vai for Spurverts, and I'm here again with my old pal. This is getting old now, isn't it, this crazy thing? It, it is. No, it isn't. Craig I love Rich. it. No, we like it. Hashtag. Boom. Boom. The Craig, the two Craigs. 